Well, hello, hello again. It's Michelle with Kato Life and Harmony. I'm on day two of my egg fast, and just a little recap from yesterday. Uh, I I had posted my video where I made eight eggs and eight tablespoons of butter, and that actually was all I ended up eating yesterday. It's supposed to be a minimum of six eggs and you know six tablespoons of fat to go with it. Um, and then, of course, you can have up to four ounces of cheese and up to three sweeteners. So I'm doing eggs again today, eight of them, but this time I'm using browned butter. So I took the eight tablespoons of butter and I browned it, and then I cooked the scrambled eggs in it. And I'll show you the browning process in just a minute. But uh, before we get there, uh, I was 167 and a half yesterday. I was 166 and a half this morning. Uh, I did... Uh, I tested my uh, blood glucose, which was at 85 this morning, and I did uh, test my ketones, which were at 0.4, so I'm in ketosis, so that's good. We'll see if those numbers improve over this five days of this fast, but uh, I just didn't feel a need to eat anything else yesterday. I was prepared in case I got hungry, but I never ended up getting hungry, so uh, we'll see how things go today with that. All right, I'll be back. And here we are making browned butter, which I'll be cooking my eggs in for today. I've had it on for maybe five, five to eight minutes, somewhere in there. It's just starting to brown now. I have it um, on this individual plate. I actually have it all the way up to five, which is the highest it goes. Um, it's a cast iron plate. And um, it's just a nice little simmer going on. And as you can see, it's getting darker. There's some foam on the top. I'm going to be cooking my eight eggs in this for my egg fast uh, today. I'm thinking by browning it, I will, sorry for hitting the camera, reducing some of the volume of these eight tablespoons of butter. May or may not have worked out that way, but we'll see. Yesterday's eggs ended up with about a tablespoon and a half to a tablespoon of liquid butter after I ate the eggs um, that I just swallowed. But I'm also hoping that browning it will um, heighten the flavor of what I'm cooking in it as well. And as you can see, the solids are going down to the bottom. That's the browned butter bits and uh, and then once I get it to a desired color then I will go ahead and pour my eggs in and scramble them up and have my main meal for the day if I'm still hungry later um, I will uh, make up I'll just have some hard-boiled eggs and maybe make up some brown butter bites that I can just eat as is. So I can get the fat in with the uh, hard-boiled eggs since I don't have any mayonnaise currently. And uh, I'll need a tablespoon of fat per egg. That would be the best idea. And every time I stir it, you see it's a, a nice golden brown right now. It's getting browner. Once it starts going, it goes fairly fast so far. I feel like I have reduced some of the volume out of here. It seems to me that there's less actual volume, but won't know until we've 
made our eggs and then see what's left over afterwards. One thing I absolutely loved about uh, cooking steak in butter is the uh, yummy, yummy leftover butter bits um, after the steak is cooked that I get to eat. So I imagine, sorry, don't mean to hit the camera. Imagine this will be very delicious. And this is the first time I have just done brown butter though, so. And I think this is also the process you do for making ghee, so the brown bits on the bottom you wouldn't have in the ghee, it would just be the liquidy bits. Um, and then clarified butter, you would do the same, only you would not go as dark in the colors. I'm just keeping it moving because I don't want to uh, have burned bits. Burned is definitely not delicious. Browned is very delicious. So I'd say right now it's uh, close to a light caramel color. And maybe even the burned bits or, or browned bits are definitely full on caramel color. Alright, I guess I'm going to cook the eggs and uh, I'll take a picture and share it um, with the video when it's done. Well, it's a uh very warm out today. Um, I still have not had anything out since those eight scrambled eggs with the browned butter, eight tablespoons. And I'm gonna make chaffles tonight. I'll probably have two, maybe four. I'll confirm tomorrow with my opening video and see how things go. But so far, day two in the bag.